many of us, this morning was kind of like Monday morning. And no matter what day of the week, it seems just getting out of the house with everything you need is a chore. It so is. It well, and we were just talking. It's hard. Mornings are hard as an adult without and so then, kids. And so then you add in kids, and it's crazy. Crazier. Yeah. Well, <laughs> our organizer, Valerie Riley, joins us this joins us with tips to make our mornings a little easier. Thanks yeah. for being here, Valerie. <laughs> I can't help you with the alarm clock situation, <laughs> but just to help you get out of bed and know that your morning's ready and taken care of, we just came up with a few short, simple tips. You've probably already thought of them. You just don't ever do that. <laughs> okay, so what are your simple tips to make morning, um, mornings a little bit better? Lay out your clothes. Lay out your kids' clothes. That um, is smart. Yeah. Five minutes. I mean, it doesn't take you long at night when you've got mm -hmm. all the time in the world, but in the morning, how long does it take you to find an outfit when you don't know what right. you're going to wear? Forever. And you try them all on. Right. And it takes mm -hmm. more time. Yeah. But if you'll just put five minutes extra into your nightly routine, mm -hmm. throw out your clothes and your workout clothes, too. If you go to the gym in the morning, mm -hmm. lay those out and then lay out what you're going to wear to work. And then you're not digging everything out. Exactly. And then it's your closet's nice and clean when you leave for the day, and it just makes you feel more organized and prepared. <laughs> and what about for kids because I know with my kids I honestly whatever you want to wear yeah go for it I, I think the same thing at night with them just take make it a routine part of their nightly getting ready for bed we go to take a bath we read a book and we pick out our outfit for the next day and it's okay to let them wear whatever they want to wear yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we've had people stop us and say oh that's a cute outfit <laughs> your kids must dress she, themselves she picked it out herself so smile and be happy <laughs> but it helps them learn how to get ready in the morning on their own and it teaches them how to be independent too so okay is there a way that you can teach your kids to pick out things that might match I think so. I think there, if you color coordinate your yeah. closet and you, like, I know if you have a kid say, okay, Mondays you're going to wear black pants and whatever matches black, and then kind of mm -hmm. make it into a routine every mm -hmm. day that they kind of know ahead of time what kind of colors to wear. Mm -hmm. And I also have friends who will lay out five outfits and they'll say, okay, you can pick, pick whichever one, one of mm -hmm. these you would like. I, to wear today. Yeah. <laughs> we look That's like a good long stockings sometimes. We have crazy outfits, but okay. Now the kitchen is crazy yes. too. Yeah, and that's the other thing you should do is pack your lunches. Mm -hmm. Pack your lunch for yourself and for your kids the night before. It's one less thing to do in the morning. We just have more time at night. I think the mornings are rushed, and also it helps you eat healthier because if you plan ahead, you can plan your meals and you can plan to have healthy snacks. And you in choose there. to eat healthier when you you're do. making your own making your own lunch. Yes. And you have time for it. Okay. It's not rushed. That's and great. we have all of Valerie's tips on our website. Thanks yes. for joining us Thank here you. today. You can find more tips from Valerie to get your family organized in her blog, 405moms.com.